Yeah, it's been a dramatic turnaround. I mean, during the campaign trail, Donald Trump rarely said anything negative about Vladimir Putin. And a lot of Republicans on Capitol Hill were worried that he was going to take a soft approach, that he was going to undo the sanctions that were put on Russia because of its taking of the Crimea from Ukraine. And everyone was expecting, you know, a much softer approach from Trump. But he's come into office, and I think the Syria, uh, the gas attack, which then sparked his decision to launch missile strikes at a Syrian airbase, have clearly opened up a really deep fissure between the U.S. and Russia. And the other thing is that while Trump himself may have spoken softly, if you look at Rex Tillerson, uh, the Secretary of State, Jim Mattis, the Secretary of Defense, Nikki Haley, the ambassador to the UN. These people are making very strong statements about Russia that are very different from the things that Donald Trump has said in recent months. So I think what you're seeing is that Donald Trump speaks in a certain way, but actually the team he's put in place around him are not going to be soft on Russia at all.